And my background is in football. I brought up in it, was uh, coached in it. I was coaching when I was actually still playing in college. Um, got into coaching and then into scouting in the NFL for the past 18 years. Finding the perfect player for a coach was sometimes difficult. They had uh, expectations where, for example, uh, they wanted a tight end that would also play fullback. You could also block on the line of scrimmage, also play from the running back position, be able to catch out of the backfield. It was a difficult situation, difficult find, but you had to do your research and you had to look at a lot of players and dig through a lot of um, individuals to try and find this player. Um, real estate is very similar. Uh, the wife might have certain expectations, she might have certain things she likes. The husband is the same way, he might like certain things. You have to dig through a lot of homes and time management is a big thing when you're looking for these homes. They don't have a lot of time to run around and look at homes that don't suit them, so you have to do the digging for them. Coming up in football, all my life my father was a coach and leaving was a tough decision. When I was in the, the football life, it was a lot of time on the road by yourself, eating alone, a lot of time on the, in the hotel rooms by yourself. But uh, I found that I was missing out a lot on the family. Now I get a lot more time with the kids. They're growing up. I get to see things that, and do things with them I didn't get a chance to in the past. We uh, joined up with a running club. And I take them to gymnastics, soccer on Saturdays, also grilling out. I give my wife the night off so she prepares my grill. Now, football was a real important part of my life. It's an integral part of my life. The skills I honed as a scout, I now apply to real estate, and that makes me a more effective real estate agent.